hey guys uh, welcome back to my channel welcome back to Tapshi tech and reviews so in today's video let's quickly see how to factory reset your Samsung phone when you have forgotten the pin so if you have forgotten a pin something like this and it says incorrect pin entered let's see how to factory reset so yeah let's get in the video please enjoy so currently I have uh, Samsung Galaxy Note 20 so I'll quickly show you all how to factory reset if you have forgotten the pin so if I enter some pin random pin and it says incorrect pin entered so I'll show you all how to factory reset so first thing is you'll have to keep the charger connected so only when the charger is connected this works so yeah be sure to connect a charger before doing this so before doing that I'll just show you all uh, what I'm going to do so what I'll be doing is I'll be pressing the power button and volume down button together and uh, once the screen comes up you know to power off or restart the phone don't leave this keep holding that and once it is completely turned off leave the uh, volume down button and press the volume up button press until you know the Samsung logo comes again so that's all I'm going to do I'll, I'll quickly show you all by not connecting the charger and show you all that it doesn't work without the charger just press the power button and volume down button together and uh, don't leave now when the screen comes up now leave the volume down button and press the volume up button so you can leave the button now and ideally ideally the other screen should come up but it will not come as you have not connected to the charger now I'll quickly show you all by connecting the charger how this actually works only when the charger is connected do this again now by connecting the charger so connected the charger so now I'll press the power and volume down button together don't leave the button yet let it completely turn off now leave the volume down button press the volume up so if you see that light light coming up for a certain duration then you can be sure that you are about to get the screen so now what you can do is come down to wipe data slash factory reset and press the power button you can use the volume button to go up and down and press the uh, power button to select that so I'll select this there will be one confirmation select factory data reset and you can see everything happening down so the data wipe is complete now you can uh, reboot the phone by going to the first option reboot system now and press the power button now the phone will be rebooted so once the phone is restarted you cannot use it immediately so once all the review is done and when you click on agree the next screen which you'll see is this one an unauthorized attempt has been made to reset your device for factory default setting connect to Wi-Fi or mobile network to verify your identity so we need to verify our identity so if you have connected to your gmail on this phone previously then that is when you'll get this you know uh, message so if you have not connected to gmail account then you'll not get this you can directly reset it if it's just a pin but if it is already logged if it was already logged into your uh, google account and there was a pin that was set and if you have forgotten the pin then you will definitely get this message so what you'll have to do is uh, connect it to a, a Wi-Fi network let me connect and come back so once connected it will uh, verify all the details and check info so the next screen which you'll see is either you can enter the pin if you remember by any chance if you don't remember still then you can opt for you know Google account instead and here you can provide the last uh, credentials which you have used on this phone so let me enter this and come back so once all the verification is done you can see a message something like this so either you can use a new account or add previous account so I'll just click add previous account and then uh, the previous account will be used uh, for this factory set as well um, so yeah that's about it guys uh, the reset is successful now you can uh, use this phone and uh, also reset the pin as well so hope this helps if you like the video please do the like button subscribe comment let's catch you in the next video until then see you bye